There it is. I'm going to go for the 50. Good luck. Great job. 50 grand it is. OK, here we go. I wish you well. Macca, for 50 grand, the chase is on. Come on, girl. Come on, excited? I am now. Yeah, you yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Right, here's your question. Good luck. Come on, Macca. Who left his studies at the London School of Economics in 1963 to pursue a career in music? A, Elton John, B, David Bowie, C, Mick Jagger. You've put Jagger. Not sure why, he just seems like the kind of guy that might study economics. Correct answer is... That is a great answer, well played. Step close to home, first one under our belt. Chase has put... Yeah, it goes right with Jagger. Here's the next question. What is served with chicken in the Spanish dish arroz con pollo? A, chips, B, eggs, C, rice. You've put rice. Pollo is chicken, right? Yeah. Arroz, got to be. Correct answer is... Yeah, rice. Step close to home. Well done, Chase has put. She comes with Bolton, she'll put chips. <laughs> <laughs> no, pasty. Everything comes with a pasty. <laughs> Does it really? Local delicacy of Bolton, I kid you not, is a pasty balm. What's a pasty balm? It's a bread roll with a pasty inside. That's your dinner. <laughs> no, it's not. I'm not kidding you. <laughs> <laughs> Here's the next question. Adapted from a Seth Graham Smith novel, a 2012 film describes Abraham Lincoln as what? A, zombie killer, B, vampire hunter, C, a werewolf breeder. <laughs> You've put vampire hunter. I think I've seen that I title. I think I've seen the film. Really? I think I have. Correct answer is... Step close to home. I love vampire stuff. I've watched all the vampire things, to be fair. I'm obsessed. Chase has put... Have you seen it? I have. It's not bad, actually. It's got um, <laughs> British actor Dominic Cooper's in it. Ah, thank you. Here's the next question. <sighs> Dystonia affects which parts of the body? A, the bones, B, the nerves, C, the muscles. <laughs> You've put... the bones. Mm, don't know that. Muscular. I'm literally to complete guess. Yeah. Correct answer is... Muscles, staying where you are. Chase has put. Yeah, it goes right, muscles. Move to one behind. We're three from home. Playing well, though. Back, I'll give you that. Here's your question. Done well thus far. <sighs> Silver Lagus palustrius hefneri is a subspecies of marsh rabbit that is named after the founder of which magazine? A. Vogue. B. Time. C. Playboy. You've put Playboy. Thinking Hefnery, you Hefner. Oh, you Hefner. <laughs> Playboy. <laughs> Correct answer is. Great. I normally pick them up. I didn't see that. Uh, well done. Congratulations. Step close home. Well done. Chase has put. Chase goes Playboy. Didn't see it. And of course, they've got a rabbit as their logo. Yeah, of course Funny. they have. Well played. Had you gone for the minus 1,000, you'd be home and dry by now. You didn't. You went for it. Big time. 50k. There's two from home. Here's your question. Artificial Christmas trees were invented during the 1930s by a company that made what common household items? A. Toothbrushes. B. Hairbrushes. C. Toilet brushes. Oh, ho, ho! You've put hairbrushes. I was going to go C, because I thought, you know... It probably, Too it obvious. Yeah, so I thought B. Correct answer is... Overthought it. Staying where you are. If the chasers put toilet brushes, we're out. Chaser has put. <laughs> Two flushes. They'd have been very small Christmas trees. <laughs> Here's your next question. Good for us. Come on, Macca. The blue badge is a qualification in the UK for which workers? A. Cycle couriers. B. Tourist guides. C. Master Bakers. Oh, got it. 
You've put tourist guides. I don't know why, but I just, I'm sure that's what it is. Yeah, but isn't that like the blue plaques and stuff on the houses, you know, the ones in the town? Is that right? Surely, isn't it? Is that correct answer is? Oh, I don't know, now I'm doubting it. Oh, great answer. Step close to home, well done, Chasers put. Yeah, OK. One more with home and drive. I wish you luck. Here's your question. Come on. Which of these hit films was released the earliest? A. Muriel's Wedding. B. My Best Friend's Wedding. C. Wedding Crashers. Oh. I haven't seen any of them. What do you reckon? Do you know what? I haven't seen any of them. Oh, disaster. All right, you've put... Let's have a look. Muriel's Wedding, so... I've heard of all of them. Yeah, yeah. I'm trying to think which one did I hear about first. All right. I, I don't know why Muriel's Wedding seems really? like it came out when I was younger. OK. To go through with 50 grand. Come on, Mako. Correct answer is... Come on. Come on, come on. Yes! <laughs> Get in!